morning. May the fourth be with you. Hey up. Hello. <laughs> How do? First day here for us in Disney World. Welcome to day one. Well, five. What day one of the other day? Travel day was the other other episode. So it feels like what it's time the same is it? day. It's now 6.15 a.m. 6.15 a.m. Skyline opens at 6.30, so we're running a little behind schedule. Because we wanted to be there about 6-ish, but because it was such a long day, we'd just had an extra half hour in bed just to give us ourselves that, that extra push. It's very quiet out at the minute, though. It is. There's not many people on the way. Soul. It's a sight. That's not a Disney song. Because um, what, Hollywood Studios opens at 7.30, so Skyline opens at 6.30. If you're new to the channel, hello. hello. I'm Danny. Welcome. He's Danny. He's Jamie. I'm Jamie. Together we are Danny and Jamie. Danny and Jamie. As the name Works. suggests. It will get a bit brighter for you. You will be able to see our lovely, best. beautiful faces soon. Come away from that, alligators. Oh, <laughs> <pardon> <laughs> the effing. Look, there's a sign, alligators and snakes. Oh my God. Stay away from the That's water's edge. Is. Danny's got a lovely May the 4th t-shirt. Leon. Uh, got to get involved in these things. I don't even like Star Wars. I've just got a normal grey like, training t-shirt on, but I've got my first visit badge and my birthday badge. It's been birthday last week. I'm dragging it out. See if we get any extra magic, any extra sparkle. I think your wrist was slow back at your birthday. <laughs> that far off. I'm just dragging it out. <laughs> um, the oh, friends, well, if you wear it, it, you sometimes get a little extra, extra magic. Yeah, so we'll see. We'll let you know if you do or not. If it's worth wearing one or not. Oh yeah, you will love it. Oh <laughs> my God, your first visit. Welcome. <laughs> so we're gonna oh, go to Skyliner, oh, yeah, yeah. Hollywood Studios Day. We've got Genie Plus, so we need to get a Rise yeah, of the Resistance. There. We've got Genie Plus ready. Jamie's signed up this morning. Yeah, you're gonna buy. Star Wars Rise of the Resistance. Rise of the Resistance Hopefully, yeah. and I'm going to try and get a Slinky Dog Dash Ooh. Lightning Lane. What time were we for that, did you say? Did you say, did you say book that in for an afternoon slot? No, we said we'll just, First thing, just, we'll just try and book it, whatever you get. Whatever we get. We'll just go on and just, it is what I'm it is. I'm excited on first day in Disney World. We've seen people do this walk countless times on YouTube. There's the Skyliner. Let's see how big the queue is. When we get there, we'll let you know roughly how long it takes to get it over and things and everything else. Because you've got to change at Riviera to go join another queue there. So, it is what it is. It is, it is what it is. As long as we're on the thing at 7 o'clock, to start doing our bookings, exactly. Don't we'll be all right. 6.20. So it's 6.20. Skyline opens at 6.30. But there is movement now. It's just started moving. So we're only just here at the... Uh, what are these? The 90s, I think maybe. I don't know, the 60s. Basically by the pool. Bit of a big big yo-yo. And it's already moving now. So hopefully it's not that it's not long. It'll be fine. I so we were coming. 20 past six we join the queue. And let's see what time it is when we get to Hollywood Studios. Just coming to Riviera, it's now half past, it took 10 minutes. There's no queue. So we're straight into Hollywood Studios. This is going far too smoothly. I told you, we're prepared, Jamie. Like far too, like there's no queue. Yeah, let's not, let's not jinx it, we're not there yet. <laughs> well, we're not, but we'll be I've seen all the down. vlogs I've seen where it goes and like weaves all around, and like massive queues. People like, it takes like an hour to get there in the morning. Morning. May the fourth be with you. Thank you. May the fourth be with you. <laughs> um, I've seen like, it takes like 40 minutes to get there and everything. But no. Not yet, anyway. Not yet. We're just there. Oh, you missed it. 6.42. We're here. 6.42. So from joining the queue to walking in at Hollywood Studios, or to join in the queue outside Hollywood Studios. It took 22 minutes. <laughs> so quick, super easy. We're here. We're here. Super easy. Whether it's like all the time, I doubt it. I don't care for you a lot, I think we're good for us. <laughs> yeah, it works perfectly for us. And we didn't feel that rushed, did we? Right. Not at all. Took our nice. time this morning, getting ready and things, having showers and whatever else. 
So a lovely chat to a couple on the skyline celebrating the honeymoon. We did, yeah, they were really nice. There were just four of us in there. So you got over it, everyone's like really friendly, like just speak to like you wherever you are. It's really nice. So now we're gonna go join a queue over here, I imagine. Looks like it, yeah. And wait to get hopefully all our tickets work and we get in smoothly. Yeah, this we is don't the, know. This is the way we have the issues now. Yeah. <laughs> we really don't know how it's gonna be. Guest entrance this way. Let's go. Oh, it is me that get picked for random bloody security checks. Oh, well, everyone walking through. Excuse me, sir, just uh, to the side here. Oh, what have I done now? Anybody frisked? <laughs> Always me, in it. On the plane getting here. You look walking into dodgy, Hollywood. Though, I must you? do. I must do. <laughs> We're in anyway. Let's go. Right. We can either go down this end or down to the far end. Let's have a look. Let's judge what it's like. That's a bigger queue. Early entry. Oh yeah, this is early entry. Let's try and so get first time. Let's go. Well, right. tickets worked. Thank God. So now we're in this part, waiting to go in. Six forty-seven. So we need at seven o'clock to be online and boom. Check your Wi-Fi. Check your Wi-Fi. You can enter. I've got the data on. He's money, paying. Money ball. Uh, money bags. <laughs> paying for data. Not me. Um, right. Let's come up with a little provisional plan then. I'm going to try and pay for rise resistance. I'm going to try and get Slinky Dog, and then we're going to go to Tower of Terror and Rock and Roller Coaster. First two rides. Yeah. Well, let's see what happens. If we, <laughs> if, if we don't get if rise. If we don't get rise, then we'll run straight there. Yeah, just wait for that. And just wait, yeah. Then it's done. When it's done, it's done. Captain Obvious again. We've done everything. You've done everything. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it is one minute past seven in the morning. Obviously, Genie Plus opens at 7 a.m. So that's when you can book your individual lightning lanes, your Genie Plus first attraction of the day, etc. So, of course, everyone was doing the same thing. I was booking our Rise of the Resistance, you were booking our Slinker. Did you get Slinker? No. No. Hey, what time for? Between... 8.55 and 9.55. So very good early time. I was booking Rise. I got a Rise for 8.35 in the morning. Boom. So we can box that off straight away. We can box Slinky off really early as well. It's pretty much straight after. So morning plan now I think we're going to do Tower of Terror. Try and get a, an early queue there. And Rock and Roller Coaster, because then during the day we'll get we'll, busy queues. We'll have one hour of park open before we need to be at uh, Rise Distance. So. And then we'll, see what we can then do we'll just take the day. Yeah. Right, we'll uh, see you when the park opens. We just wanted to update you. We're doing it. We're doing it. Seven oh five. We are in the park. It's a mad rush because I guarantee everyone will be trying to get to Star Wars. But we've already got it. We do. So our plan is like all oh, this Mickey and Minnie's as well. A lot of people will be trying to rope drop that about as well. So. Yeah, we don't have a plan because, as you know, if you plan, you can be disappointed. So we're just going to go with the flow, keep refreshing the tip board throughout the day. If something comes up, it comes up. And that'll be us. There's all, all the people going to Galaxy's Edge. We don't want to do that. We want to go... I don't know where we're going. Well, we're going to the Tower of Terror, which I'm not sure where it is because... <laughs> Because we've not been before, so we could we should have really looked on the app on the map and be like that. We'll have a but mooch. We'll have a look. We'll find it. We'll find it. It's hey, right. We're in no rush now. We've got and now we're in R for just free time now. People for the obviously rise of the resistance. I'm sure everyone knows, but you, if you queue, you can be queuing up to three hours sometimes for it. It's insane. You can. Uh, right. That, the tower's over there. Should we go that way? It might be quite over this way as well, first thing now. I think so, because it's going to get definitely get a queue later. Because once everyone's run to Star Wars, then they'll obviously come over this way. <laughs> there Look it is, that. that's where we're going. Look at that view. Boom. Oh, it looks like the looks the same. Cabinet's less finger 
cool little thing on May the 4th, getting married in Hollywood Studios. Woo! <laughs> How cool. <laughs> Well, who'd have thought it? Our very first ride on our very first trip to Disney World would have been Tower of Terror. Tower of Terror. Good ride, wasn't it? Yeah, it was good. There will be spoilers for all the rides that we do, so yeah. if you want to, uh, don't want to hear any spoilers, don't watch the videos. <laughs> but yeah, Tower of Terror, what did you think of it? No, it was good. It was very, obviously, I've done the Paris one multiple yeah, times. Yeah, we're going to compare everything to Paris. Um, so you went in, it's exactly the same, you know, into the lift, same seating area, same get up, you know, and then it closes and then we start to go up. And I was just expecting just to go up and start the drop tower and dropping, but then the doors open, do you when you watch like the little thing? But then the lift moved into the tower. It goes through like a corridor, doesn't it? Doing, and it's also like a mini dark ride and you're moving around, you watch it. And then it shoots you up and down. It was it was mad, but the, the girl next to us was like, oh, like this is new. Well, we weren't so, expecting that. We started going forward, we were like, oh my God, what's going on? That was really cool. I thought it was a good the, surprise. The drops were good. You got some good air time on the drops, but I don't think it was as intense as the Paris one, but it was good. I could I agree with it. that. I could agree with that. Still a very good ride though, to start the day. Sun's coming out now, it's starting oh, to warm up. Elton, I'm gonna get a tan here. I was very worried about the temperature over here, not gonna lie guys, because as you know, I'm not the slimmest, the slimmest guy. So I was a little bit, oh look at that, there's bubbles coming out of the bin. I was That's worried about I, it being so hot, so I thought, first day today, I'll test it out, I'll wear like a, one of them training kind of tops, like that football shirt material, what do you call it? I don't know. But it's, not, it's nice at the minute. what kind of material they wear. Well, no, because that's one of the things that I worry about being so hot and things yeah, and sweating and everything yeah. else. What time is it? But it's really cool at the minute. It's just, it's just nice. It's isn't nice, it? yeah, really pleasant. Like not sweaty, not hot. It's not stuck. A little breeze. I love, I've just got the sky, I just love how clear the sky is. Like. You, don't get, you don't get this in Burnley, I'll tell you that. Amazing. You do not. Oh, Gallic is well late with Star Wars man now. Well, that's booked for half eight, in it? Half an hour. So let's get some in in 30 minutes. Let's head to like this way. Let's go this way. I think, what's down there? We don't know. We don't know. Like I say, because we don't really plan. If you, well, we, we have, within reason, made a plan, but not in fact of let's do this, 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 this. We're going to be just refreshing the tip board throughout the day and uh, something pops up, happy days. That's it, once we've done Rise at half eight and Slinky just after What's it. What's the wait free. for Mickey and Minna? I'm just having a look now. I don't think it can be that long. We'll check out and we'll, we'll let you know what we do. Want to take a ride on the train? What could possibly go wrong? Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Just done that. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's good that. Um, 25 minute wait, we've come off in 25 minutes. Yeah, we've done it. So no, that was good, really uh, immersive ride. I say, I didn't know anything about it. Jamie's seen spoilers and stuff as such. But yeah, no, I really enjoyed that, did you? Yeah, I thought it was really good. good. 
really good idea. Like the rooms are so much bigger, the rides so much better than the actual videos and things. Like, did not disappoint. Really yeah. good. Like when you're there in real life, obviously it always looks better than vlogs and stuff, doesn't it? Like, oh, hundred percent. Like you actually feel the wind of the tornado. It's proper windy. And there, like the movement when you're doing the dancing in the ballroom. Oh, so <laughs> that was cool. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, no, I enjoyed that, but. Now it's time for the big one. We are off to Rise of the Resistance. Rise time. We've got 10 minutes till our slot opens. Um, so that's where we're going. No. Woo! Head fourth and all, you've got to do, uh, do it properly. Um, I'm excited now. I'll say I am, I'm, I'm, I'm proper smiling This now. is the one when I was when I booked the holiday, like, I knew all about, oh, it's, this is the big ride, it's so popular. It's about the best that. dark ride in the world. So, Everyone said it's like, thank you so much. <laughs> Lovely cash memories there. Um, yeah, and we saw a couple on the skyline from over this morning. They did it yesterday, I think they were saying. And he was like, man, it's awesome. Like, uh, <laughs> you don't need to do the accents. <laughs> it was like, um, he's like, it's the best ride the ever. The videos you see online do not do it justice. Stop talking in the accent. Just, just say <laughs> what he said, though. Well, he said, yeah, he said, videos don't do it justice. He said, when you're, everything's 10 times bigger and more better. So, very excited. Let's get to uh, Star Wars land. Is that where we're going? Star Wars land? That too. Batu. We're in Batu. Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. We have just transported. Oh my god, I can see like a, a spaceship. It's not the Millennium Falcon, not yet. It's like an X Wing. What was this queue for then? I've no idea, mate. No idea. I thought you knew everything. This might be for Smuggler's Run. The little things are caught. All the grenades are caught. No, I don't want to get one of them. Six dollars for that. I've got one in my bag anyway. You get to keep the grenade? Yeah, it's oh, the bottom one of them. It's a bottle, isn't it? And it's got a Batu writing on it. I see me new apartment. Oh, uh, is that an X Wing? I think it's an X Wing. Is this Rise of the Resistance? Yeah. Must be. It's got to be. Right, let's get our lightning lane then. Lightning lane. Yeah. Lightning lane's there. Enter, enter here. Five minutes early. No, you can. You usually work five minutes early. Come on. We walked over there. I was like, oh. Here we go. It's time. May the fourth be with you. <laughs> you gotta get into it. You can't say anything because you're wearing the t-shirt. I wasn't saying anything. Are your face said enough? <laughs> for once, I'm not any any no Disney attire for me. Right, let's go. So normal wait is 130 minutes, so we'll let you know how long the lightning lane is. Obviously May the 4th, it is Star Wars Day, it's the main Star Wars attraction, it's exactly half past eight now. So we got in five minutes early as well from our reservation. Um, so let's see how, how far the merge point is and let's go. Mate, you buzzing. <laughs> You'd missed the bin. The effort with it, the thought with that. It's doing the right thing. Uh, no, it's exciting. Uh, Rise of the Resistance on Star Wars. <laughs> and I'm a massive fan of Star Wars. I love all that stuff. I love how you couldn't think of what to say Star Wars related. <laughs> no, D2 on Team D2. Right. There's BB-8, down there, BB-8's up there. Yeah, I'm aware. BB-8. Oh, so obviously the, uh, the first part of the ride isn't working. Well, that's where you get usually transported and then the first order capture you and take you and you come out here and you come out the first order ship. It's not working with our first time. We've not had the full experience. Oh my God, pictures. God, look at it. That's a bit thing that the um, first part of it isn't working, but that's not part of the ride, so that's just like backstory. So basically, we'll do, we'll do it again. So basically, we've been, we've been captured now oh, by the yeah. first door. They're the bad guys. Right, okay, okay. And now they've sucked us up into <laughs> the what? <laughs> and brought us aboard. Like the, the Star Destroyer, yeah, I yeah. think. So we're up to escape, aren't we? 
pretty much. We've, well, we've been captured, it's more problem. Because we're part yeah. of the resistance. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I understand that. So we're going to fight that. Exactly. Yeah. Bring it on. completed how long did that take then we joined at half past so 18 minutes 130 minute queue 18 minutes with the lightning lane so obviously that was minus the um the scene where you get captured but other than that everything else is on um yeah go on then you might need to edit a bit of bleeps it incredible <laughs> <laughs> you enjoy it Nah, that was sick. Um, I thought it, it was, that was so good. Should we? Um, yeah. Like, I'm lost for words. I'm lost for words. How that cost a fortune. Like when the stormtroopers were shooting, pieces of the ceiling were getting blown off. Like they were literally chucked, yeah. going missing. And I thought some of the things were like real people. It was that good. Yeah. Like like the stormtrooper, the yeah, thing there, it looks like, so real. Oh, it's incredible. And even when you walk in and all the stormtroopers are there on the that first initial yeah, you are. Yeah, yeah, like, wow. But the right oh, it's like you're on a movie set. <laughs> that is insane. Like the videos, like you say, don't do it justice. Well worth the fifteen dollars we spent yeah. on that. Yeah. Well to save 130 minutes, but like they say, the videos do not do it justice at all. Oh, that was so so good. incredible. What time is it now? 48. So we need to go do Slinky, Slinky's don't we? Open now, Which yeah. is five that way. Go do so Slinky. we'll do Slinky, then we'll come back and do kind oh, of Galaxy's I'm Edge. And after farting the, uh, the bad people at Star Wars. I was literally the whole way around, my face was just. <laughs> that was really good. Really, really good. So yeah, now we've got our slinky dog lightning. Once we use this, we can book our we next lightning lane. Look and see what we fancy doing. And then obviously we will come back in. We'll do um, Galaxy's Edge and things in a few days. On our next time back in Galaxy's Edge, we've got Olga's Cantina books as well. We do. Looking forward to um, that. For a couple of drinks. We couldn't get in today. Uh, probably understandable. <laughs> so yeah, Toy Story from Star Wars to Toy Story. Time to get shrunken down to the side of a toy. Slinky dog, lightning lane. Let's go. It's open now for us, Jay. Let's go. Lego. Get it because Lego's a toy. Lego. Could be a wee as well. Uh, we're trying to do fan hey, toilet hey, first. Hey, we'll see what we my name first. is Woody. You new to these parts? Well, I hope you enjoy playing with toys because it's playtime. Yeah, it's playtime. 
First link yet. Hoping for somewhere near the back. You know, you know we like a back row ride. A back row ride. Look at that, it's only four days ago, so I'm extending it for one day. I won't wear it the whole holiday. Just let me have one day of it being my birthday. 60 minutes to Toy Story Mania. Oh, they've got Woody's lunchbox in there, I think, which is like um, food and things. Oh. Temperature update. What temperature is it now? Has you got it on your phone? I've had it on my phone for weeks. Go on, what is it? <laughs> 75. What's that? What's that for English? <laughs> 75 Farron, which is... Hold on. So 24 degrees at 9am. Oh, 24 degrees. It's only 9 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. And it's 24 it's degrees. It's I've literally started sweating now as well. I'm like, warm, proper hot. Because it's no clouds, no shade. It is just bum. Oh, training tops is away. Don't show sweat. Nice and cool, light breezer. But we've got a lightning lane. Straight here for Slinky Dog. I got a slink in my boot. Yeah, that's what I, I got a snake in my boot. There's a snake in my boot. Right, let's go. Good, thank you. Here we go. What was the standby? I did. I'll tell you now. Slinky oh, dog dash. 55 minute standby now. So let's see what it is for us. Nine o'clock exactly. Your back's a bit wet. Yes, yeah, so I think we're in a bag in it. Right. You got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. So as soon as we scan that one, we can book the next lightning lane. As soon as that one's scanned, uh, gotta get my car back out again. So obviously we've just scanned in our second lightning lane at the touch point. So Slinky Dog is there. And then we've just booked our next lightning lane. It's exactly, it's about three minutes past nine now. So we've booked our next lightning lane for 20 past nine, the Rock and Roller Coaster. So as soon as we come off this, we'll head straight to Rock and Roller Coaster, jump on that, and then we'll look again for our next lightning lane. Row number nine, we didn't even ask. She just row number nine, please. We were like, where's that back row? Boom! <laughs> Everything's just working out so far. In the words of Mickey and Me's Runaway Mile Train, Runaway Railway, nothing can stop us now. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> Famous last yeah. words. So no, no, we ride, I don't really know much about. I'm very excited though. First roller coaster of the trip. Followed by Rock and Roller Coaster coming up next. But now, let's take you on Slinky Dog. <laughs> well, we have just been on Slinky, you have to take our word from it. But, numb not to see you. Thought he pressed record, but I didn't press record. So when we got into the station and I pressed stop, it started recording and I went, oh no. It's always next time. Do it again. It's always next time. <laughs> Oh, cracker. Right, we've got rock and roll across the lightning lane now. Let's go. And I won't be showing you that either because that's very dark inside. Very, very fast, very turbulent. Well, we didn't scan for our picture there. Oh, did they have it? Yeah, it's a picture took our picture. Well, let's go and get it. Here we go. Well, we've just come inside one man's dream. Just be, uh, which is all like the history of Walt and the parks and everything else. Not to watch the little movie preview they're showing, but because they've got Meet Sully from Monsters Inc in here. So we're just gonna pop our head in and see what the queue is like. Um, so yeah, before we go and do Rock and Roller Coaster. And if it's not too bad, then we'll meet Sully. Scratch that, so the queue was 30 minutes. So instead we're gonna box out some rides first. And then uh, maybe later on, or on our second day back, once we've done other things, we can prioritise different things, um, like characters. <laughs> so let's go and do Rock and Roller Coaster. Everyone knows I'm a massive fan of meeting characters. As long as it's Belle. <laughs> yeah, as long as it's Belle or any other pretty princess. 
not stuffed animals, but each to their own. It's a monster. <laughs> James P. Sullivan. <laughs> <laughs> right, here we go. Right, off we go. Where are we going? We're that way. A roller coaster, innit? And just like that, outside the Hollywood Brown Derby, Derby, the Chip and Dale. There's Dale. <laughs> and there's Chip. <laughs> so because we didn't see Sully in that, we've been walking around the way, on our way to Rock and Roller Coaster, which our lightning lane starts in about two minutes. Um, we saw Chip and Dale, so I snapped a quick picture with them. And then there was a photo pass photographer like, taking pictures in front of the Tower of Terror. No one stood there, so I thought, oh, can we get a photo? So said, absolutely. So we just had a few photos. <laughs> Danny went, never do that to me again. <laughs> what was wrong? Barry's seen, isn't it? Why? We can take our own pictures, aren't we? Stood in the middle of a street. When we've got, when we've got a photo pass, memory maker, yeah, and there's three the professional photos, then why not? Yeah, but not my cup of tea, that shit. Well, there'll be plenty of me. Plenty of me. Exactly. Rock and roller coaster time. Just around here. So we've just done rock and roller roller coaster. <laughs> um, I love how you call it that. Always have, always will. Zero minute wait. Yeah, uh, zero minute lightning lane, absolutely perfect. Just walk straight down in on the ride. Um, 60 minute estimate, yeah. uh, advertised standby. 60 minute normal queue, so yeah, you can't beat it. Definitely worth $15 for a day, this. 100%. And then while we've gone through scanned in there, I booked us a Star Tours. Yeah, we're going now. back to Star Wars. We're going to do Star Tours now. We'll do that and then again we'll look on, see what we can get. But it's all going it's, to plan, we can go home soon. It's 20 to 10 in the morning and we've pretty much nearly ticked off all our bucket rides. All the big rides here, yeah. Um, and then we'll have time for Indiana Jones Stunt Show, Beauty and the Beast on live oh, on stage. Yeah. I'll see Belle do a thing later. And maybe a couple of characters. Is it too early for an ice cream? No. no, it's not too early. We'll get on ice cream soon. I know, that's why I just I don't want hand scoop though, I want <laughs> proper Mr. Whippy. Where's Mr. Like Whippy? Doll whip kind of. Oh yeah, we need to go over it. Well no, yeah, let's head over there now. Go and do I a bit of Star where it is, we can find it. We'll uh, see you back in Galaxy's Edge. I don't think it's over there. Oh yeah, well we'll see wherever we go. Where <laughs> I think we need Star to be. was there before they built Galaxy. Oh my god, they've got a huge AT AT here. Yeah? Look at that. Ah, ah. From, that was incredible when you go in Rise of the Resistance and you go through them like in between the legs or whatever and you, you see them. Incredible, wasn't it? You'll see it all in the comfort and convenience of your stars in your seat. So no matter what your destination, experience the IC360 sensation. It's the seating way to see the galaxy. Oh, another zero minute wait for Star Tours, thanks to the Genie Plus. Uh, definitely worth the $15 so far for it. Um, yeah, we're walking straight on to everything. It was advertised 30 minute wait. We were straight onto the ride. So we've just put now, it's 10 o'clock. We've just booked a Toy Story Mania for 10.30. The times are starting to creep up now. The only other thing left for Toy Story Mania, really, I think will be Smuggler's Run and alien swirling saucers, which we're not really fussed about swirling saucers. So smugglers run. And then obviously a couple of shows and things. So we're just stopping off at the ABC uh, commissary to get some food. I've gone for the buffalo chicken grilled cheese sandwich with steak fries. What are you going for? Grilled cheese. Grilled cheese. There we go. So we'll get the food and we'll show you what it's like. Here it is. A buffalo grilled cheese, buffalo chicken grilled cheese, something with ranch and steak fries, loads of ketchup. I've got the butternut ranch dressing, controversial. I know from Pixie Bust Adventures, Chloe loves it, Alan hates it. I'll be the judge, the jury, and the executioner. And I got a Diet Coke, a bit of Diet Coke. All right, let's tuck into this, and I'll let you know what you think. Right, the controversial ranch dip. That's nice. 
Chloe, Pit Sinister Adventures. You're right, it's nice. Alan, sorry mate. It's lovely. Don't know what your issue is. The grilled cheese. Let's try that. It's nice, got a little kick to it. A slight kick. Yeah, buffalo flavour. It's nice. It is what it says on the tin. So, let's see Danny's reviewing it. I don't think he's going to be keen on it, but let's see. I want to know why. Wasn't what I was expecting. No. Too bad the kids have a cheese on. <laughs> Kick to it, hasn't it? Oh, hello. Good morning. <laughs> Did you not know that was not? Welcome to the vlog. Lunch with Nanny. Alright, cheese. Do you like it? Hey, it's getting warm outside now. Yeah, it's weird. Brilliant food review. <laughs> it's weird. No, it's good, I see. Pouring out. Like, I thought it was going to be like a cheese toasty, but quite thick, quite. We went plenty of cheese. There's a bit of chicken in there as well. Yeah, but all chicken. Four chicken and cheese, yeah. Oh, it's right, enough that. Sauce looks good. Thick cut fries, yeah. The chips are nice. We'll do a job at this. Like, when I was saying to you earlier, look, when I come out to theme parks, I don't really eat much. I'm going to stay hydrated, but this will put me on now till tea time. I might have a little snack during daylight, but yeah. Happy days, and everywhere you go, bless me, we'll say, may the force be with you. And I'm like, and you too. <laughs> Having a great day. Here he is with his accent. <laughs> so now we've got Toy Story Mania, a lightning lane. As soon as we've scanned him for that, we'll get online and start looking for our next one. I reckon we might start having to book later in the day now, though, and stack up with them. You know, start stacking them. Because as we're looking, things are getting a bit later, late, late, like I'm six, seven, eight, aren't I'm they? just happy to be in the sunshine. I'm it's been gorgeous weather. Oh, excuse me. But because we've just been um, in the air to come back out to it, oh, it's lovely. It doesn't feel too hot though. Like before, it was like really scorching sweater, but now it feels nice again. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. No, <laughs> I'm not making any sense. Right, we'll go do Mania, Toy Story Mania, and then, uh, yeah, we'll show you a I bit around. I believe this is a shooting laser gun thing, so it's not a ride. Almost, like a shooting game. You'll enjoy it, I think. It's fun it's carnival games. Jewel. I've never, I've Buzz. never ridden it, but well, I've never ridden it, but oh, it looks fun. Let's give it a go. Then. Rough of a Here we go. <laughs> that was, that was go no, you didn't. You, we missed that. Thank God. So slight change of plan. Uh, Toy Story Mania is down, so we've just booked another lightning lane now for um, Frozen sing along. So we're gonna sit down, let our food. Digest. Oh, yeah, and it's been it's not I feel bloated. I'm dead like. Uh, so that's in 10 minutes. Um, so it's one of them. It was the only thing really that was on for now. We want to see it. So we're going to have a bit of a laugh. Sit maybe some after aircon. I go some beef show and see my belt. Well, that's because we've smashed this morning and we've been so lucky and done all these rides. Uh, we can now enjoy shows and everything. And yeah. And it's not even that busy. We were just. Same to the same couple we saw this morning. They were sat on the sky, we got the sky rider over with another couple. Bumped into them and they were like, no, it's not busy over in Star Wars on. Um, so yeah, considering it's May the 4th, I don't feel overcrowded at all. Uh, lovely jubbler. Right, let's go and sing a few Frozen songs. See, I've been searching my heart. You were singing that yesterday. You were. Cool, anyway, what we've <laughs> what we've just done while we're sat waiting for the show to like let in, been refreshing on the uh, My Disney Experience app, and we've managed to snag a Smuggler's Run 
for five to one, 12.55. It was saying seven o'clock, eight o'clock, seven o'clock, eight o'clock. Kept refreshing, 12.55, so in two hours. And if you don't know the words, just follow along. I have a feeling we already know the words. Okay, where should we start? Let it go, let it go. No, 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 no. Too soon, there's to be one, so save it. <laughs> hey, what were you thinking? Wherever good stories start, the beginning. Do you want to build a snowman? Come on, let's go and play. Okay, this is cheeseburger. All right. And this is a side of fries. Oh, right. Actually, four sides. Uh -huh. Let the fourth be with me. Uh -huh. Hey! What is wrong with this one? Yeah. <laughs> You'll feel no resistance when somebody puts food in front of me. Uh -huh. I'm going to be me eat that. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> so we just come out of Frozen. What do you think of Frozen? Yeah, it was all right. It was, uh, it was quite funny in parts. The ending, obviously, the ending's like a spectacular, in it. Um, yeah. Elsa really, really fit. <laughs> uh, Arnold was right. She was really cute. Uh, not very nice. Yeah. I thought the woman narrator was so funny. She was just proper, the way she was talking as well, I was here. Yeah, was <laughs> she cool. was just, oh, she would proper have me creasing at some point. Um, yeah, I really love that. Singing along as well. The snow at the end, I mean, she got a bit carried away, our Elsa. Oh, <laughs> buddy, drenched. We've just come to the front of Hollywood Studios and guess who is here of all people, the one and only Kyle Paolo everyone. Hey everybody, welcome to <laughs> Disney. May the 4th be with you. May the 4th be with you. Thank you so much man. Thank you man. Thank awesome. You. <laughs> welcome to Disney. <laughs> Meeting the in the Florida heat, frozen cokes. They had frozen lemonade and they had like blueberry slushes. Um, a couple of other options as well, didn't they? JD and Co. Yeah, they had some bottles of alcohol there, so I presume you can spike them if you want to. Uh, we're going to head round to Star Wars Land now, because apart from doing rides, we haven't even been into the land. We haven't seen the Millennium Falcon or anything yet. Not had my photo taken for Instagram. And with it being like peak time, or midday now, sunshine is beautiful. Nice and hot. It's very hot, very hot. I'm so like glad I wore this like thin kind of activity shirt. Sure. <laughs> activity, activity. Well, that, well hey, training, activity. training top. It's an activity. An activity, <laughs> hey. Oh, that's what then. <laughs> Apologies, mum. So, yeah, because if I had a normal t-shirt, oh, I'd be oh, sweating me back out. You can breathe in that, you can breathe. Well, it doesn't, also, it doesn't show the sweat marks either. So, uh, so true. So, yeah. I've got about five of these different colours and things um, oh, in my case, so then, I might end up just washing them and re-wearing re them rather than wearing any of my normal t-shirts, to be honest, if it stays like this hot. You do what you want to do. What I will. Hey, whatever makes me comfortable. No one's on me is going to judge you. We're all about openness and self-love. <laughs> the only reason I mentioned it is because it's one of the things that I was worried about was the heat and being bigger. And I don't sweat. You know me, I don't sweat. Jamie doesn't sweat. <laughs> Um, I don't want to be walking around sweaty and horrible and, and everything what? else. Since I've, put, I've just put some tanning oil on outside, now I feel sweaty, now I've put that on before that. Yeah, we've dry just dry tanned, uh, tanned, tanned I've put sweaty. sun cream on, you've oh. put tanning oil, tanning tanning oil, oil on. Oh, yes. It's going to burn. It'd be like Madge out of Benidorm by the end of the holiday. <laughs> right, oh, should we go to Star Wars yeah. land then? Batu. There it is. Walking through like the marketplace here in Batu, you got like shops, um, all merch and places and things. Um, it's not noticeably busier in this part now. Um, maybe as we get towards the Millennium Falcon, it might be even busier or quieter. I don't know if it's like compact narrow streets, but this kind of area looks like all shops. Oh, and there's popcorn as well, and I think there's a quick service there because people are eating food. Ah, this is the Bronto Roasters place. 
It's where they do the Ronto Roaster wrap. So in breakfast, they're like a breakfast Ronto Roasters. And then now they do like the, the normal lunch side. I was just smelling that popcorn, it smells so nice. It did, didn't it? Oh my god, I see the Millennium Falcon. Holy moly. It's so much bigger in real life. That's what I told me it's kill. We all thought that in. That was just personal banter. Are you ready to see the Millennium Falcon? Three, two, one, boom. Wow, 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 wow. Looks insane. And the detail on it. Holy moly. Just see some stormtroopers down here. Not only stormtroopers, but Kylo Ren. I thought it was Darth Vader. <laughs> <laughs> but it, apparently it's not. Kylo Ren's kind of taken over, hasn't he? Uh, Darth Vader's a thing of the past now. I prefer Darth Vader. Or yeah. Darth Maul. Do you want to have a look? <laughs> Turn it around. Better yeah, than looking at us. Go on. So directly opposite the big, is that a TIE Fighter? I think that's a TIE Fighter, is where you get the green and blue milk. Just had a frozen cook, so I'm not ready for one yet, but we will be getting one uh, before the day's up. Yeah? Maybe. Or maybe, maybe. The next or maybe the next time. We'll have one though at some point. We'll I don't like to have schedule one. my milk. <laughs> 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 what? So in 10 minutes we're going to be on... Yeah, oh, it's magic. What's on Magic Mobile? What's on Mag Genie Plus? Right, it's milk time now. <laughs> yeah. <for> milk. <laughs> 10 minutes and we'll be at Smuggler's Run. We're just going to mooch around Batu, have a look around. And yeah. It's very cool how they do it all. Like, uh, it looks go incredible. Into, like, another land, don't you? Uh, more stormtroopers up there. Let's go oh, this way. Not these, Al. We haven't been over here. It is, there's droids everywhere, oh, yeah, stormtroopers. We can go for Smuggler's. Yeah. I don't know what kind of ride is smugglers race. Uh, a bit like Star Tours, apart from you either pilot the ship oh, so you drive yeah, it. Yeah, I've seen it. I've repair seen it, it or you're a gunner. Yeah. Uh -huh. So a simulator ride. Yeah. Stormtroopers are off. Yeah. And so you got some work to do. Nah, uh, this <laughs> themselves. <laughs> it's all you the coming. Soul's coming. <laughs> Underneath where they meet all the pod racers. The, uh, obviously Anakin and that does the pod racing. Again, I don't know which film it's from. Just remember the pod racing. That's cool. And just like that, Chewbacca is at the Millennium Falcon and Ray. First time coming on. We are pilots. We're driving the Millennium Falcon. We're flying the Millennium Falcon. Here we go. Alright, this way For your safety, remain seated and supervise young lanes. Oh my god. Right, we'll see you in a bit. Alright, my friends. You brought the Falcon back in one piece, and I guess that is something. <laughs> Not a lot, but something. Welcome back to Batu. Well, that was fun. We were the pilots. I thought we did very well because we only crashed twice. Daddy went the wrong way, took us into a big rock. But other than that, we missed everything, didn't we? We didn't crash at all. But the score was only 43%, so. Right, enjoy it? Yeah, no, it's good. Fun. What happens if you press them? Nothing. Nothing happens. Curiosity killed the cat. No good visuals, good fun. Just like Star Tours, thinking it what you're moving it about. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. Really enjoyed it. Oh, Happy days. Tell, tell, tell. I didn't hear you were no, I didn't film the ride. It was a weeping the entire time. Oh, yeah, I was like, woo! 
And then when he pulled the thing to the line, he it was like, pull it to the line, I was like, everybody ready, let's go! <laughs> oh god, I know. So I thought we did really well, but <laughs> I think you just made all that stuff up. Yeah, they must do. They must do. Um, right, we'll come up with a next part of action. We need to look for our next lightning lane now. And uh, yeah, but that's it. We've done every single big ride in the park. The only things we haven't done is Muppet Vision and alien swirling saucers and that's it isn't it correct if i'm right in terms yeah. of rides so i mean we can go and do them maybe um and then yeah it's like the whole park complete and then we can do beauty and the beast half past one in the afternoon is that all it is no it's not even half past one yet oh my god oh it's not barbecue doesn't it? oh it smells good doesn't it at ronto roasters right we'll come up with a little plan and uh yeah we're absolutely smashing today Right, we've picked up another lightning lane. Tower of Terror was showing for half five. So I kept refreshing, refreshing. And uh, we've managed to go for 10 past two, which is good. So, should we go this way? Out of Star Wars land now. And uh, yeah, there's only Muppet Vision now and Alien Swirling Saucers before we've done every single ride. We do want to try and get another Slinky Dash so we can actually film it this time. What an absolute idiot I was <laughs> but we got the picture anyway so hey ho there we go wait time 15 minutes 15 minutes we're going to see the big monster that is James P. Sullivan hey <laughs> Sully James James P. Sullivan how are you man can I have a cuddle I will oh you're so fluffy. <laughs> it's summer. <laughs> Yay. How's Mike? Have you seen him recently? Yeah? What about the abominable snowman? Is he about these days? Yeah, here and there. Comes and goes. <laughs> what do you think for the afternoon? We're going to watch a couple of shows. Indiana and Beauty and the Beast yeah. on stage yes, 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 yes. because so that's it now <laughs> I mean we've done very well 2 o'clock in the afternoon I've got another 7 hours here um, yeah we're 20 to 9 is the, the first show and then at 9 o'clock there's like a celebration of animation show as well. see what happens I don't to plan anything really no? oh Chip and Dale are skipping along the grass oh, having a picnic you. no they're in the picnic blanket they're trying to sort a picnic out but they're having a bit of a fight <laughs> We've reached that point in the day where Lightning Lanes, Genie Plus, completed it mate. Um, we didn't realise but it turns out you can only use a Lightning Lane on every attraction once. So like say you've we booked Rock and Roller Coaster, you can only use Lightning Lane once. Tower of Terror, you can only use once. Um, so obviously this morning we didn't use a Lightning Lane, we just rope dropped it and went straight in. So now we've, we've Lightning Lane it, now we can't go on again. We realised that because we came out of Tower of Terror, we tried to book a rock and roller coaster, and it was like guest has exceeded the or reached the limit that they can use for this attraction. So I asked at guest services, and yeah, she was like, "Oh, I don't really come across this a lot." She was like, "Yeah, it's limited to one per attraction." She went especially like a day like today. We were like, "Oh, here we are." I mean, we've got the multiple experiences which we're going to use for Toy Story Mania, aren't we? That we were supposed to use originally. Yeah. Because it's again, it's another thing ticked off. And then there's only swirling saucers, but we're not bothered about it. Like, if one pops up, uh, there are lightning lanes for it still, we might just jump on it just to say we've done it. Something to do, a bit of a time killer before I go and see Belle. Um, but yeah, we're gonna watch Beauty and the Beast and the Indiana Jones shows, we've decided. Um, and then, yeah, just kind of mooch around. We can probably join the queue for Slinky Dog, um, sitting around an hour. So it's not too bad, I mean. But we've just stopped for a light refreshment, haven't we? So I'm on a draft beer, a Bud Light, and you're on? I'm on, I've got a bit more manly than Jamie. I've got a strawberry frozen daiquiri. Happy days. And so, I'm loading my socials. Loading pictures. All well, the pictures outside studio. Well, we met Kyle earlier, Kyle Palo. We've now just met Jojo as well. Oh, I've got a little picture, I'll put that in now. It's like Pokemon, isn't it? Catch them all. 
<laughs> um, so yeah, we're having a nice day. We're just chilling in a bit of shade. Danny wants a bit of sun. I want a bit of shade. Oh, the sun worship for me. Yeah, it's uh, far too warm. Tanned as tanned as possible. Um, well, you got a nice colour though. Yeah, absolutely. Well, you got another 13 days in it, yeah? I do. We'll enjoy our drinks and we'll catch up with you in a bit. Cheers, all the best. Cheers. Happy Star Wars Day. Mr. Incredible! You're the man! The man! And uh, no capes! And now it's time for Indiana Jones. That starts at three o'clock now. Starts at quarter past three. So we're gonna go watch Indiana Jones, epic stunt spectacular. And then four o'clock, Beauty and the Beast. Right? Yeah. That's the plan. Let's go. Before that. Da -da -da -da, da -da -da. Very quick turnaround uh, while we we're uh, waiting for Indiana Jones Epic Stunt Spectacular to start. We booked a lightning lane. Really, we could have just come in anyway for um, Beauty and the Beast live on stage. So, we're gonna watch that. It's about a 25 minute show. Uh, my girlfriend is in this, so I'm gonna cheer her on. Does she know she's your girlfriend? Yeah. <laughs> Very funny. We'll watch this and then, yeah, we'll, come up with the we'll see what the wait times are. Because obviously we've got to do standby for pretty much everything now, apart from swirling saucers and Muppets 3D. No, no, um, no. So yeah, let's watch no. this and let's see what happens. We invite you to relax, pull up a chair, as the dining room proudly presents your dinner. So we bought the swirling saucer just because it's the only thing really that we that we can book using the, the lightning lane now. That's it, yeah, um, well use it. Genie Puss completed it mate. Just smashed right. it innit? <laughs> you wanna know how to do Disney? Watch us. <laughs> Someone come with him next time as well. He says me, asshole. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm joking, I'm having a great day. We've got uh, um, so we've got the sun shining now, doing a couple more rides, and then we're gonna have a bit of a chill, a bit of a mood, because we say we don't really know what we're doing now until the evening. Just some chores. re rides and that, and then yeah, we'll yeah, just see you guys in the chores, evening, really. So yeah, we're going to enjoy a couple of these smaller little fun rides for Jamie. <laughs> They can't see us though, but we're in Muppet Vision 3D. We did um, Swirling so uh, Mania, Midway Mania. I'll put the scores in now so you can see. I won. We enjoyed it though, we enjoyed a bit of fun. So now, 
Yeah, it was a lot of fun, but anything. I was saying, I've come all this way and my gun didn't work again. Well, I mean, did you just lost? <laughs> Muppet Vision, let's go. Well then, a bit of a change of plan. Excuse my hat hair, I've got a ring on my head as well where my hat's been. That change of plan, you'll notice. We're back in the room. What time is it? Seven o'clock now. We've got another two hours until like the evening show things kind of start the projection shows at Hollywood Studios. The only two short ones, like one at 20 to 9 and one at 9 o'clock. But because we were, well, in a way so successful today at Hollywood Studios with all our lightning lanes and basically completing all of the rides and not being able to book any more lightning lanes because we've already used one for each ride. We were just finding ourselves meandering around um, and not really doing much. We went back and did Rock and Roller Coaster again um, and other things. But we just thought, you know what, we, we had an early start, especially after a long travel day, not much sleep. We were up at, what, half oh. six this morning. Oh, we were on the oh, sky ride at half six. We were up at half five. <laughs> so we thought, you know what? We'll come back and then the evening shows. I we'll see on our we'll see on our second day that we're at the Hollywood Studios, um, and we'll just go and have a later start. We'll go in like the afternoon, and we'll have a later start with it all because uh, we've already done everything in there now. Yeah. Um, I mean, don't be wrong. We might still book a Rise of the Resistance again in the morning. Yeah. Just so we can go and do it and book Genie Plus and stack up some lightning lanes for that afternoon that evening. Um, but yeah, for today we were just like feeling a bit ugh. So what we're gonna do is go around to the pool um, down here, just have a little dip and a chill, get some food around the resort and that, and just kind of have a chill crash. evening, aren't we, and crash. I'd like to be probably back here in room in bed for like nine-ish and put telly on or something, a bit of food, mm. snacks, and just crash and chat. And yeah, we've got Epcot tomorrow. Um, try and get a bit more sleep tonight. That's gonna be a long day. Come over here. That's but Tomorrow, I'm very excited to watch Webcot tomorrow, and I've seen on Instagram, um, I, don't know if I think it might be what, Disney what food position blog, you in, yeah. but they're doing, um, they've got this like, ger if you can see the German pavilion, it's like caramel butter shortbread, oh, looks insane, can't wait to get one of them. Mm. And you get to meet Belle? Oh no, Give I don't her a hug. want to wear. <laughs> Hang on. Do you think wearing like, a formal shirt to Epcot is a bit too much. Yeah, it's not too it? much, but I think you'll be hot. <laughs> no, I know. But yeah, I don't know what to wear. I'm excited to meet. I'm going to have a shave. Make sure I look nice. I'm so excited. It's so pretty. Like, so if I could have like my perfect girlfriend, it would be Belle. There you go. You've heard it here first. If you're out there, Danny D two four six or one on Instagram. <laughs> Do you want me to link it on the video? Yes, please. <laughs> There it is then. That's well, it'd be interesting video. because I saw Bell today in studios doing the show, the B and the B show. It was all right, nothing special. Um, yeah, it was, it was okay. all right. I think for the kiddies, it would probably be a bit better, but for us, it was all right. Um, but yeah, Epcot Bell tomorrow. Well, be you're swapping me down here. And then um, <laughs> Magic Kingdom Bell. That's a whole other Bell. <laughs> what? They're all different bells, aren't they? It's not the same girl who does it all. That's true. But, um, yeah, tomorrow I think it's daytime, Belle. Yeah, in May a French. Or whatever it is. <laughs> May <Belle>. now. <laughs> that, that, now, that's a whole other <laughs> different kind of Belle. <laughs> I meant a milking outfit. No, no, no. A really milking she, out. When she's in the village getting the milk, I don't know what she does. <laughs> she's going getting she books and bo things. Oh, she, wait, books. I thought she was getting milk from market. <laughs> she's in a maid outfit, in a milking outfit. <laughs> I just want to speak to her tomorrow. I think I'll pump uh, something out water. I'll just show her this clip. But, yeah, I love it. Uh, right, so are we ending it here? Or. Unless you want to see us strip off and go to the pool. So I'll probably end it here. <laughs> well, you want to get your picture with your top off anyway. I do. Try and get some attention because I'm feeling down and low. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to now go chill by the pool for a bit. We'll Head be back off. with you in a couple of minutes. Um, and we'll let you know about the day, our favourite things and all that kind of stuff. What it was like May the 4th. What we get for tea. And yeah. <laughs> 
See you in a little bit. See you in a bit for the end of the day review. Bye. <laughs> We're back. I mean, for a little chill by the pool, but the sun wasn't shining back time we got down there. But it was still quite nice to have a little just rest after a long, busy first day. And then we... I had a swim. I had a dip and a swim while you didn't swim, but you cloud bathed. I cloud bathed. It was really nice. I just liked it. It's still a nice temperature. Going on. Um, then we had some food. Now I've got a famous Tada cheesecake for pudding. Still got a little bit of room. Let's try this. Now, anyone who knows me personally knows I love a cheesecake. Love the cheesecake. So if you didn't know that. Have we getting any crumbs on my bed? But the thing bed? is, it's not like, oh, look, it's rainbow cheesecake. It says, if you can see that. Yeah. But it says, obviously, cheesecake back in England, we've got like a biscuit crumb, you know, digestive or biscoff. This just looks like it's just more of a bloody, I don't know what it is. It's like a, a moussey kind of thing, isn't it? But it's very airy. We'll give it a go. Okay, go right down so it's bottom. quite thicker than... Go right down to the bottom. Got a full. Oh no, there is a bit of a... Exactly the same thing you can see at the bottom. Base. Ah, oh, cement mixer. I'm just trying to like get all the flavours around my mouth. Is that red velvet base? It's very nice. I, I dread to think the amount of E numbers in this. But no, it's very, it's very nice. It's sweet. Yeah, it's nice. Does I don't it really... taste like cheesecake. Yeah, no, it does. It does. It's got that cheesecake texture to the filling, which I was a bit dubious about at first. Other countries don't seem to do cheesecake like you know we're all new to cheesecake back in the UK. But no, it's nice. There we go, cracking review. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I think it is a red velvet. If anyone knows, is that a red velvet base? Have you had it before? Let me know. Well, no, I like it. $5.99, I think that were. There we go, then. There we go. Cheesecake review. So, first day is done. It's now 9.40 in the evening. Shattered. So it's... I mean, we didn't. We were originally going to stay all day at the uh, Hollywood Studios, but I say because we'd completed everything very early, we got to a point where we were like just trying to kill time. And we had like what two hours or so we'd left to come. I don't know. Sounds like just saying that in Disney. Yeah, but we're like we we're going back. Every show, we show all three shows: Frozen, Indiana, Epic Stunt, Beauty and the yeah. Beast. We did every ride: Tower of Terror twice, Rock and Roller Coaster twice. twice. We did Rise at Resistance. Rise at Smugglers, Smugglers Run. Run. We did every, every single ride. Alien Get, Swirl, in Alien Toy Story Swirl, Mania, yeah. Slinky Dog. Everything, we've done it all. So I was like, well, we're going back. We've got that part booked in another two times yet. So we said, well, let's just, it's been a long, long couple of days. So let's just go back and chill for a bit and we'll watch the evening shows next time. Favourite part of the day? Favourite part of the day, I think. I've got a couple. I'm allowed a couple. Yeah. Seeing Belle. She's my favourite princess. That, that That's here. Favourite character. Favourite character, if you can call her a character. She's real to me. Um, Rise of the Resistance, obviously. I've been looking forward to doing that since I knew I was coming and what I've watched of everything that's here. That's been like the big hype rise. So I was buzzing to do that and it was incredible. That was really, yeah. really good. And one more favourite thing, I'll have to have three. So I know it sounds a bit like corny or cheesy, but it was like when I scanned in for the first time this morning. Because like you see it all obviously on the vlogs you watch, if people going in, you this they tap and it scans and it all goes green with whatever it beep it makes and you go in. I thought, oh that, that'll be me soon. And then that was me this morning and and I was in for my first day. So I, that was nice. What was your favourite part that day? Rise of the Resistance was incredible. Like, proper lived up and was so much better than I thought it was going to be. Obviously, I've watched it so many times on vlogs. It was awesome. Um, meeting Sully because he was my first character hug. Uh, <laughs> you alright? No, yeah. it was though. Like, seeing the, f the first character, because when we went to Paris, we couldn't 
hug him or anything else. And so he just being there and giving him a hug and chatting and uh, it just felt like it was normal, you know, and I don't know, to me it just felt like the magic was back. Okay. Yeah, probably um, Rock and Roller Coaster oh, or yeah, Slinky. I forgot to mention the that. The first ride on Rock and Roller, we had a Dead Good Songs. Uh, I didn't know what, what to expect. Way? What yeah, way? I didn't know what to expect from the actual ride. I've done Paris, but it was just so good. And no, Do, you know what? Genie Plus. Uh, I didn't think I would, but for us today, well, value for money. We got a value for money we, on we, that. We did every single ride. Ten we times we got to the point where we actually couldn't book anything else on Genie Plus because you can only use it once per ride. And the girl was like, we were like, oh, we're just trying to use it. And it's not letting us do it. Is it, is it just once per thing? And she was like, you guys have done all the rides. <laughs> like, I'm not used to that. <laughs> she was like, yeah. And this was at like two o'clock. We went well, she was like, that's a good dilemma to be in. You've done all the rides. And normally people are like, why'd you keep doing this? <laughs> waiting on all day. I'm like, oh my God, Jessica. <laughs> <laughs> she said that. But I've not slept that, in four days. I'm going delirious. But we we're at Epcot tomorrow, that's our plan. Yes, Epcot next episode. We're not going to buy Disney Genie Plus because, one, it's not a very ride-intensive park, two, it's so spread out, and three, we're going to have a bit of a, a later start. Um, we're not gonna, we're going to start our alarm yeah. for 9 a.m. park opens, is it 9, nine until 9? Till nine, till nine, I think, isn't it? So, extra magic hours from half nine, but we're just going to set our alarm for nine and aim to be on the Skyliner for, for ten. Um, because one, we want to stay for Harmonious, the big evening night time spectacular there, because it's supposed to be amazing. Um, and it's like the production has got the most fireworks in any Disney World show. Mm. Um, so we really want to stay for that. And we're just going to take it easy and just, no yeah. plan, we're just going to walk around the world and go on a few rides. If we Have don't do it all in one day tomorrow, shortbread it won't matter because we'll be back there in a few snack. days again. Or in a week. But tomorrow will be quite nice just to Chill wander it. around and not go ride to ride to ride. Whereas today it was like ride, 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 ride. Yeah. Where we can just wander tomorrow. 100% have a couple of drinks around and the just, world and like look at it all, which will be nice. But it has been a very long couple of days, you know, with the travel day, then 20 the hour day travel day. Here, day nice four hours sleep. A bit and more today. of a chill day tomorrow. Bit of a, there's no point in tiring yourself out in Disney World. There's no, you, nothing worse. You got two, we've got two weeks of this. So you got to, you know, take it easy some days as well. So it'll be really nice tomorrow to have that kind of chill day. 100%. All the snacks, the food, and Belle. Get to meet Belle. Where's Belle? German Pavilion. French Pavilion. French Pavilion. She's supposed to be a fan, yeah. French. I, know, I, don't know she, I don't know what she's up to tomorrow. <laughs> she's not messaged me yet. But yeah, French Pavilion. That well, makes she's sense, like, actually. Like, Bonjour. She's like, good morgen. Good morgen. <laughs> good morgen, Danny. <laughs> Good, uh, oh, I don't know what we're chatting you know. right but yeah big day tomorrow us. if it's your sure. first time seeing us thank you very much for watching it sticking with it may the fourth be with you and so yeah we'll see you next week hopefully and stick Epcot. around yeah if you don't you're a loss you're a loss, <laughs> you're a loss. <laughs> like the video please subscribe comment down below tell us you love us follow our socials oh, so you're gonna do all that jazz all that jazz all linked, <laughs> all that jazz. But yeah, we've had a great first day here in Disney World. Can't complain at all. Here's to the next two weeks. So, uh, goodbye.